Hello everyone and welcome back to some more House Flipper. Here we are today. Possibly ready to finish this place up or pretty well close to it and leave it for the next episode to deal with. So we're going to start off basically right where I was kind of thinking here. Let's just plop that there. We'll work on getting our benches in around that. Is it anything less darker now? Mm. So yes, so we can get. Well, that's fine. So we get that guy in there. See if we can squeeze in here for these guys. Ooh, that's fancy. Now I think I just want to put on a corner piece there. Ah. Um, that one can go in there like that, and now I can't really turn any other way. Oh well. Now, this side, what are we going to be able to get in here now? That and, ooh, neat. Yeah, I don't mind that at all. So we can just continue the bench like that. And I wonder what corner piece fits in there. Elegantly enough, at least. Hmm, damn. That was a really well sized room. Okay, it's a little tighter than what I was hoping for in some spots, but. Eh. Yay, Georgia's back up top now. <clears throat> Yeah, sun lights aren't in here either. Uh, let's get decorative in here then, shall we? Why not? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> oh, Lord. Lordy lordy, the hiccups have got me good now. I apologize. Grr. There we go. <laughs> Yay, now we can work on the bedroom. It's gonna involve a lot. Um, flip off, like <clears throat> God. Don't understand what's with my controller in this game today. Are you all right? <laughs> you need an adult. I think it needs an adult. That's a pretty big bed. Plop that like right into the corner. Oh, lights in the way. There's no big bedroom? This isn't a big bedroom? You wouldn't call this a big bedroom? What? Is it because there's no more wardrobes? Wow, that 68 square meters isn't a big enough bedroom for you. What constitutes a large room for these people? I don't understand. And those wardrobes weren't even registering as anything.
So we're gonna go with chest of drawers then, yeah. Oh my god, can I have my controller back? Like, come on, game. Flip, this is annoying. What is going on here? Like, he's not liking any type of wardrobe things. Being put in. He has absolutely no care. No care whatsoever. What did he do to this game? Like, did the people that did the Xbox version do a better job? I don't understand. Oh my god, I'm uh, too tired for this. I shouldn't be doing these these late this late at night. I gotta stop sticking around so long with Spy. Holy Moses. Uh, this is not like, I don't. Let me put a itty bitsy portion of my clothes in this house. No place for all my clothes. There's a pretty large bedroom here. What, is it because you need two bedrooms? This is a large master bedroom, would be very helpful. Do, does he need two? Hmm. Okay. Alright. Yeah, that was so helpful. <sighs> oh, my lord. Okay. Get the hell out of there. I don't even care anymore. Bed. Just give me a stupid bed and put it there. This guy, this guy, doesn't register that this is a big bedroom until you put it in a tiny bedroom. Like, what? Oh, man, man. <laughs> oh. Okay. Have a different plan then. Cause I don't like that. That's really ugly. But here, I wonder if I could go like this. <laughs> yes, because now that's a teeny tiny bedroom. But it doesn't look like a teeny tiny bedroom. <laughs> oh, yeah, this thing. Go away. <laughs> if I really want to, I could pack that in a closet, too. Hmm. But no, no, that's pretty good. I'll get the. Uh, what was that? We're not going to have that on here anymore. Yeah, no, it was like sunny. Orange, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, sunny yellow. Let's get small camp.
I don't worry about the inside unless I have the extra paint for it. Which I probably will. Holy Moses, that didn't take much. Do. All right. <clears throat> so, who else did we have that issue with? We had that issue with somebody. Oh, little Jimmy there that we just did. He wanted a larger living room. So, I guess we should have given him two living rooms or split that one up into two. The one would have been smaller, and then the one would have been oh, larger. Whatever. <sighs> oh, my Atlanta. Even one after this, maybe we will just flip and sell this one. <sighs> that irritated me. Ugh. He doesn't say anything with the order of either. They're not going. He's not getting green. Hmm. I don't like that. I don't understand what's going on with their triggers anymore now. Maybe a lot of their updates are constantly changing it. It's just like crazy. I mean, you put in two bathtubs and double wind comes up in the top, like... Well, you know what? We still have space, wall space and all this other space for wardrobes. So let's get that in. Maybe we'll run the less risk of itsy bitsy clothes and up the water spout. Throwing things in there anywhere. <laughs> anywhere it will go. Perfect. <laughs> now let's keep adding more drums. <clears throat> <laughs> uh, what else we got? <clears throat> Maybe we should get one of those in there, right? Um, let's check out both of these. No. Yeah. Uh -uh. We don't have wind. I'll <laughs> oh, find I'll go with something else. How about that? More chest of drawers. I don't, I don't know what else to say really, I mean... 
fits right up his alley for really wounds. Oh, let's flip it. Just flip it. <laughs> See no place for all my clothes. Seriously, all of those wardrobes. <laughs> you still think that? Not making much profit on that, are we? Oh, freaking hell! I'm bad for a quick flip, I guess. But God dang it! I so screwed that up meant to negotiate a little bit. Well, we got I'm a Believer for Gorgio and Junior Estate Agent unlocked. So that must have been like selling 10 houses, I guess. That's not a lot. I'm gonna get right down to it, you yeah. know. Yep, sold 10. <laughs> so... Let's see if we're gonna work on one of the other guys next, like Raphael, Dolan, and Raphael left. Yeah. Dolan and Raphael left. I think they're gonna need nicer houses than a simple apartment. Um. I'm gonna call Madman Legends. I know I forked Raphael in there before. But he wants multiple bedrooms, so I don't know how I could really do that because there's only. Yeah, there's not really room for multiple bedrooms, plus he wants a sauna. <clears throat> you know what I mean? Um. I'm just gonna thick it. Hmm. It doesn't give us much on internal pictures, does it? This is a garden flipper property, though. One floor, nine rooms. 146 square meters. That's bigger than the apartments, technically. That's not bad. I'd like to see some of the interior shots, but... Uh, one of the rooms and some of our size probably counts as a garage too, which is a little lame. House with a sea view. I can be right up Dolan's alley. Forty nine square meters, twelve rooms, two floors. Yeah, what the heck? Let's do that. We'll do this for old Dolan. <clears throat> See what kind of mess we just got ourselves into here for the rest of this episode. That sounds good to me. And I'll try to start these a little earlier tomorrow. <laughs> try to PvP less of spot. <laughs> uh so we have a yard if we all it is good fun. I don't like I don't enjoy it, but we have a yard to clean up here. Um, neat, neat, neat. Uh, alternate entrance to the upstairs. Cool, 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 cool. And then this is what the exterior. Oh no, this the exterior entrance. Ah. Uh, Mm -hmm. I like that. I almost want to use this as the office. Like, waiting room into his office. Convert, shift this all downstairs. Maybe? And yeah, we got room down here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, there's tons of room down here. Yeah, so really what we can do is take <clears throat> everything that's upstairs, shift it down, 
block this off up here like with a wall and a door right there interesting yeah and then we can turn this all into possibly either a hallway or a waiting room into his office kind of i don't know if i want this into his office i kind of want that in his office that'd be really cool but then it's like what are we gonna do with all this back here there's still a lot of space here Dylan's just wants a bedroom and a bathroom, office, and a hallway. Cheap furniture. Besides the hallway and the office. Lots of bookshelves. But I think he still wants a kitchen. He doesn't say anything about no kitchen, but... I can put a kitchen still downstairs, that's fine. Um, yeah, we have like tons of room downstairs for junk. I don't know how much any of this stuff's worth, so we might just sell it all so we can start working with the cheapest stuff possible and then the most expensive stuff possible for the right rooms. Um, probably end up gut. Oh wow. Gutting out a lot of this. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Looks like, oh yeah, I kind of want. So we can even fence that off too. In a way, because I kind of want it to be like that's his customer entrance. Hmm. Perhaps the front could be the hallway waiting room. And you can wait outside as well. And uh, when you're buzzed, you have to come back through here. <laughs> so this would be a good size office. This would be a good size waiting area. Hall, oh, some big blocked off. Let's turn this into a bath, like a regular use bathroom for everybody. Oh, I think that would turn out pretty good. Yeah, I think I want to sell off everything and start from scratch. For like an yeah, apex engine. <laughs> okay. But yeah, I think this could work, right? What's with this little cubby hole? It's like right, right here. Right, right here. Where is that? Where is that? That's like right in here somewhere. Huh, weird. Well, we'll end up finding that out when we smash this all out next episode, I think. Up here, I don't really think there's gonna be a lot of smashing going on. Be more building or anything, I think. I'm selling lots, uh, selling junk. <sighs> Flip off game. Not in the mood tonight. <laughs> lot of, oh, those are cool cupboards. Lot of selling junk here, though. Maybe that's what we'll do this episode. The rest of this episode, let's go through and sell everything now. Leave us with all the stuff to clean. And. Um, that... No, just redo it all. That's all fine, that's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Wait, I looked right at him. The rest is probably pretty good. Let's go and get the rest of this sell off. The next episode we'll come in, get everything cleaned up, small smash through, 
false belt, starting to figure out and laid out more and more of where we want to go with things for Dolan. Okay, so there's definitely a lot to this place. I like it. It'd be a nice spot for him, I think. Oh, boy, I am ready for bed already. Oh my lord, I don't think I'll make it till 10. <laughs> or... <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> see how it goes. Um, let's see. Good, good, good. Just gonna play a little bit of Fallout and go through the arena and the pit. But, uh, we'll see how it happens here. I think I could probably pull that off. Oh lord, what's all this now? <laughs> yeah, Dolan, I'm not filling it up with books for you. I'll get you bookcases, but I'm not filling it out full of books for you. That's just... No. Um... Gonna sell off everything pretty well. Push it here, yeah. Yeah, just make sure those, uh, double checks sell everything off the internal walls because it's just gonna fall out anyways. <laughs> there we go, and we should be set to start tackling the cleaning at the very least in the next episode. And smashy, smashy, buildy, buildy clean up the lawn and we'll go from there but until then i'd like to thank you all for sticking around hope you have enjoyed and holy moses that is a dirty building okay lots of work still ahead of us here that is okay right folks that's right